Welcome back, everybody, to my main play world, Grimm's World, formerly Grimm SMP, of course. So today, you can see we're in the nether. I made a makeshift uh, frog farm. Uh, it's kind of manual, uh, kind of automatic. Uh, so I'm just playing around with the little things that I want to do. I want some frog lights. Obviously, I want to get the frog light achievement. I've waited long enough. And the skeleton achievement. So let's uh, take a look over here, doing it this way. This is about two hours worth of work. Not too shabby, not too shabby, I'd say. Um, so let me, oh, what do we got in here? Okay, we got our hoppers. That's right, I was gonna put the rest of the hoppers down there and just have the floor all hoppers, but eh, we'll come back later to that. That's not essential right now. So I, I kind of like it, you know, it's, it's efficient. Like I said, that's about two hours, and we got about, what, 35, 34, 33 ish stacks or so. Almost 34. And a bunch of magma, which we need a bunch of uh, magma cubes for the Guardian, the Mind Out Guardian area farm. Uh, I got a farm idea in mind for part of that uh, Guardian farm that I mined completely out. I mean, it's not completely, completely, but hey. We'll come back to this later, as, like I said, it's not done, it's just a beginning. And plus, we gotta get the green frog and the white frogs in there, so... Let me go ahead and get up out of this nether. I gotta probably spend a month mini-series doing some nether work. Because this is... Not up to par. Alright, let's do a little time skip here. Alright, we're out here at my... Uh, another fortress. I want to do a little bit of research uh, while I'm out here and hopefully get some blaze rods and wither skeleton heads because I do need a, another beacon or two or four. So I'm hoping that uh, I can spend a few minutes out here and just get what I need to do and get up out of here. But like I said, I want to do some research because I do still need another wart. So like the top part's at like 80. Let's get rid of these guys real quick. We throw this over there so we don't touch it. Okay, let's see. And then this is my way underneath the uh, uh, blaze spawner over here. Because this one didn't have any nether war. I mean, I haven't completely explored all of it, but for the most part I have. Alright, so I do need to set up a blaze farm. And I do need to set up a wither skeleton farm. Since we have our magma farm pretty much set up now. Okay, is there a... Yep, there he is. Okay. Don't fall down, please. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Come over here. Give me your head. Give me your head. Oh, man. All right. That's not it. Okay, so we're at 68. I kind of want to know how far it goes down. Like, the bottom layer of this is going to be, I think, like, 20 or 30. I don't really have a safe way to go down. Wait, can I mine one of these pillars down? Oh, jeez, oh, Pete, you just scared me. Where did, where did you come from, dude? Oh, jump scare. Why, I have no idea. Okay. So maybe we can mine down one of these spots here. I don't know if this is dumb or not. But I guess as long as we're cautious, we can. Okay, I have gone down here before. Okay, stay crouch. Okay, so we're relatively safe. Okay, uh, I'm going to do this for a quick second. And like I said, I just want to see what the bottom layer is because I want to find another nether fortress. So I can get some nether wart. BRB. I know it's going to be dark. Okay, it looks like Y26 roughly is, is the bottom of the pillar. So if I just start mining it. Actually, you know what? Maybe I just go from here. Because I can always pillar back up. Uh, I'm probably underneath some lava, but that's probably okay. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to mine straight out here about a thousand blocks. And then I'll... 500 to 1,000, and then I'll check back in every so often. 
until I find another another fortress. I need another wart. BRB. I've waited way too long. <laughs>